The correct answer is Tunnel Rhino. I had an ap <laughs> I, I was mapping it out after I stopped recording the last episode. So I'm like, alright, Blizzard Buffalo, Toxic Seahorse. And then, like, the only one that made sense was Tunnel Rhino. And once I came up with that epiphany, I was like, oh yeah. Tunnel Rhino I actually like quite a bit. He's probably one of my favorites. I don't know why. I mean, I really like Drill Man back in the day, so maybe it's this weird obsession of drills I'm not aware of. A couple interesting things in the stage we're sadly not going to be able to make use of until we get um, some upgrades later on. These hopper enemies are kind of weird. They try to drop boulders on us, and then when that fails, they shoot missiles at us. Why bother with the boulders? Wouldn't tracking missiles be more effective in the first place? These things aren't uh, terribly dangerous. They just kind of try to obstruct your way. And these things we saw in Blizzard Buffalo stage, except now they're made of rock. Now here we have a secret area with the heart tank, but sadly, can't get through there. We need Volt Catfish's weapon, and we need um, the power-up for the Mega Buster, which is in Neon Tiger stage. So, nothing going there for now. This, just to show off, does not hurt, which, <laughs> when I first played this game, which is actually right when it came out many years ago, you know, I assumed that thing would either hurt you or be instant death. So, of course, I tried my absolute hardest to avoid it, and it wasn't until probably, like, my third playthrough of the game that I finally got hit by it, and it didn't kill me. I was like, seriously? I've been trying this hard all this time to avoid it, and it doesn't even kill you. Now, it does forcefully push you down, easy sea tank ever. So, you know, if you're over spikes or something, yeah, then you're gonna die. No problem there. Now, here's why I hate this stage. Most of my complaints about this game are the mid-bosses. Oh, wrong gate. This is the bit bite gate. Okay, we're not at the mid-boss yet. So obviously, bit and bite weren't here. Uh, it's completely random which stages they show up in. I'm not sure if they only spawn in two stages at a time. I'm Actually, I'm probably... I mean, that would make sense. That's how the X-Hunters worked in X2, but... <clears throat> These things, the important thing to remember is when you kill them, they launch two drills immediately. Uh, if you're uh, not paying attention, it's very easy to forget that. You can climb on these things as long as you don't actually touch the little head. It's the only part that can actually damage you. Otherwise, they're basically just a wall. Okay, I thought that was a fake too. I'm kind of paranoid about everything. Yeah, okay, that's one I missed. Same thing. Volt Catfish, charge up. That leads to the Dr. Light Capsule with the helmet upgrade. <sighs> Going in to fight the mini boss in great shape here. I do not like this mini boss at all. Got a tank. It's got two parts to the body. If you're touching the wall when it rams into it, you'll get knocked straight down. Otherwise, he'll uh, do that. And I hate dodging this. That hurts you if you touch it. I mean, what? I, I, I hate that thing so bloody much. I, what, what am I supposed to do? Ah, that's right, I forgot to suicide my last guy, didn't I? I'll be right back. Okay, we're in a little bit better shape this time. Didn't do anything special, just took my game over and ran back here. Yeah, just do that a thousand times. Like, I... I, like, I don't, I don't see how I'm supposed to dodge it when he does that. 
Just been killing this thing by trial and error for the last God knows how many years. I'm sure there's some ridiculously retarded easy way to kill this guy. <laughs> what was that? That's <laughs> like the most delayed death I've ever seen. Yeah, I'm sure there's a Maverick weapon that completely lays waste to that thing, but I don't know what it is. I never really took the time to find out. Mm -hmm. Uh oh, uh oh. This could be. What do I got? Acid burst and frost shield, huh? Oh. Really? I was going to say, where's that spawn me? Because we're going to have problems depending on where it spawns me. I'm sorry, is this before the mini boss? This looks suspiciously before the mini boss. It is before the mini boss. I hate this stage. That is honestly why I don't normally do it early in the order. Because even though Tunnel Rhino is weak to Toxic Seahorse, I usually kill him towards the end of the order just because I hate the mini boss. You know what? I'm just going to experiment now. I want to see if something kills him really quick. Oh my god. Eh, certainly that doesn't. Kind of imagine that'd be a little slow going if it was the Frost Shield. If I had to put money on something, I'd say it was probably weak to Volt Catfish, like, you know, everything else in this stage. You know what? If you want to just keep doing that, that is fine with me. Just going to fast forward that because I'm not going to sit here and watch it again. Definitely can't believe the ridiculous amount of damage the energy bolt from these crab things do. I just, I just want to run away from him. Anything down here? No? Alright. Gee. Really? Game is really hating me now. Okay. Tunnel Rhino. A little similar to Blizzard Buffalo in that he loves to charge you. Then he's got that, the Tornado Fang. And accidentally dashing up is no fun. Okay, X keeps wanting to dash up for some reason. Oh, game, why do you hate me so much? Hmm. 
We've seen most of his tricks. He's got one other thing to show us. He's got his spread. Really? He's got his spread claw there. Spread claw, spread drill. He can stop his charge a little bit early, so if you air dash over him too early, he can hit you. There we go. When he switches colors and turns red like that, he's invincible. That's the last of that, but thankfully we don't need much more. Probably the most fail you'll see in one video for quite some time. We got a pretty useful weapon, Tornado Fang. <laughs> Suspiciously similar to Frost Shield, except it doesn't leave a hazard on the ground, but it's a weapon that has its uses. Okay, so... Yep, yeah, next time we're gonna go after, as much as I hate his stage again, uh, we're gonna go after Volt Catfish, so I will see you then.